Tom Weisel grew up in Milwaukee on ice. A five-time junior national speed skating champion, he had ice in his veins. He narrowly missed a spot on the U.S. speed skating team for the 1960 Squaw Valley Olympics. But his lifetime passion would be skiing, not skating. The friendships he built as an undergrad at Stanford with future ski pioneers like Roger Christ and John Beaupre set the hook, as did a stint as a hard skiing handyman at the Alta Lodge, followed by friendships he built with skiers at the Harvard Business School with names like Michael Bloomberg and Eric Bjorgen. After securing his degrees, Weisel would set his sights on the business world and soon would be known as the alpha male of Wall Street West, while also feeding the ski bug by buying vacation properties at Snowbird and Sun Valley. Combining a high-tech banking background with his clear passion for skiing and world-class athletics, Weisel joined the U.S. Ski Team Board in 1977 and became its chairman in 1983. Weisel and the network of trustees he recruited would go on to provide the U.S. ski and snowboard team with more than $100 million in financial support, pushing the program to its highest levels. From the 1984 team that visited the Reagan White House after its golden performance in Sarajevo, to the 2010 squad's record 21 medal haul at the Vancouver Olympics. But you can't put a price tag on Weisel's leadership, vision, and passion for the team and its athletes. When times were tough, he personally co-signed loans to keep the organization running, embarked on a 10-year process to merge the team with the grassroots U.S. Ski Association, creating top-to-bottom oversight. Weisel recruited board members from Michael Bloomberg to Sam Zell and Dexter Payne the current USSA chairman. He nurtured relationships from Subaru to Putnam Investments, the team's current title sponsor. Weisel personally witnessed many of the team's greatest successes, leading Phil Mayer to say that he never lost a race with Tom on hand. He received the USSA's highest honor in 1999, the Julius Blagan Award, the USOC's prestigious George Steinbrenner Award in 2011, and in November of 2017, fellow trustees endowed the U.S. team's head men's alpine coach position in Tom Weisel's name. But, says Weisel, his induction tonight is really a testament to all of the trustees of the U.S. ski and snowboard team over the years. Ultra competitive, Weisel was a five-time national and three-time world Masters cycling champion who enjoyed leading team members on their summer training rides up Mount Tamalpais near his home in Marin County. Forward thinking and street savvy, Weisel's company Montgomery Securities would lead the IPOs of companies ranging from applied materials to Amgen and Yahoo to Micron. Later, after founding Thomas Weisel Partners, he would be named Investment Banker of the Year and receive a Lifetime National Achievement Award from the National Venture Capital Association. Tom Weisel Partners became part of Stiefel Financial in 2010 with Weisel as co-chairman. Free of the day-to-day -day demands of running an investment bank, Weisel is an acclaimed collector of modern art, an elected trustee of the San Francisco Museum of Modern Art, and the biggest fan of his son Kipling, a U.S. ski team member who raced World Cup this season. He has seven children and eight grandchildren with his current wife, Janet Barnes. For his unmatched support and love of competitive skiing in the U.S. for more than four decades, Tom Weisel earns election into the U.S. Ski and Snowboard Hall of Fame.